Now, let's bring up Wisconsin. All right. Yes! You look absolutely gorgeous tonight. How is your spirit? How are the nerves, darling? Honestly, I have not been nervous this whole competition because I have just been so excited and prepared. And coming from a small town in Wisconsin to being on the Miss USA stage, I'm just glad that I can set an example for others to do the same. I love it. Well, that's not even the question. Okay. <laughs> that's not even the question. Well, Wisconsin, here is your final question. As the brand ambassador for Miss USA, what will be your contribution to the organization? My contribution to the organization will be proving that anyone can define age-limiting opportunities. As one of the youngest contestants here, I have paved the way for myself. From being 15 years old and starting my platform, Catwalk for a Cause, towards now being successful in the industry as a free agent, I have done that for myself. Pageantry creates a foundation, not just to implement change, but to do it yourself, and I have been able to do that. So with the Miss USA organization, I think that I align with the goals and I am ready to get to work tomorrow morning. Great answer. Thank you, Wisconsin. Amazing. All right, for our next final question, let's bring up Miss Texas. Hi, Miss Texas. How is your spirit? How are you feeling? Hello. Hi, everyone. I'm feeling so good. I actually just had the craziest moment backstage where my dress uh, ripped. And so, but I'm here and I'm so excited to be here in the final five. Yes. So exciting. Resilience. Yes. Well, Texas, here is your final question. As the brand ambassador for Miss USA, what will be your contribution to the organization? Well, I'm here in honor of my mom. She passed away back in December due to ALS. And one thing I learned is to always have hope and be resilient and never give up. And that's what I'm doing today here is not giving up on myself, not on my dreams. And that's the, me that's the message I want to share with everyone, to not give up on yourself and continue to fight for your dreams because we only have one life to live, so we need to make the most out of it. Beautiful job, Miss Texas. Thank you. All right, now let's bring up Utah. Hello, beautiful Utah. How's your spirit? How are your nerves? I am feeling so at peace right now. I have been working for this moment for years and years, and I'm just so grateful to be here. I'm more excited than anything. I love that. Well, Utah, here is your final question. As the brand ambassador for Miss USA, what will be your contribution to the organization? I believe the ability to connect with people is an incredibly important asset that a Miss USA should have. The United States of America is an incredibly diverse country, probably one of the most diverse in the entire world. So being able to connect with everybody is important. As a bilingual Venezuelan American woman, I plan to connect with that community of people because the United States of America is a diverse country. And in Miss USA, it needs to be able to represent every community, no matter their background, their race, their ethnicity, anything. And I would like to be that Miss USA. Thank you. Fabulous. Thank you, Utah. Utah. Thank you, Utah. Now, let's bring up Hawaii for her final question. Hi, beautiful Hawaii. How is your spirit? How are your nerves? Oh, you know, I always have Hawaii in my heart, so I'm just bringing the aloha spirit on the stage tonight. Okay. Hawaii, here is your final question. As the brand ambassador for Miss USA, what will be your contribution to the organization? Well, I'm a program director for a nonprofit called What Makes You Feel Beautiful, and it's my passion to be of service, to uplift the younger generation, to teach them the importance of cultivating self-love. And I believe as Miss USA, I can reach the whole nation to show kindness, be a lending hand in this society, and believe in yourself. Mahalo. Thank you, Hawaii. Beautiful job. Thank you so much. Now, Pennsylvania, come on down for your final question. All right, Pennsylvania. Yes, dress. Uh, how's your spirit? How are your nerves? I feel surprisingly very calm right now. I feel so grounded in who I am, and I'm so proud to be up here representing my state. I love that. Well, Pennsylvania, here is your final question. 
As the brand ambassador for Miss USA, what will be your contribution to the organization? I think for me, my greatest contribution is to give back to young women, specifically women of color who may feel like they're excluded from this world. I think that it's really important standing here as a black woman in the top five of Miss USA that I be the face of representation for the Miss USA brand moving forward. And that is something that I intend to do. Pennsylvania, yes. Thank you, Pennsylvania. And that's the last of our final questions. Jordan Morgan, okay, we need to know, how do you think our finalists answered?